Hi and welcome to another video by Get It Done Home Repairs. Today's project we're going to be installing a new soap dispenser on this uh, countertop here. Now we already removed the old soap dispenser that was in here as well as the faucet and we're going to be installing the new one. Now this just happens to be the brand that I picked up uh, but your personal preference or whatever you prefer. Uh, it's very easy to install. This is our new replacement. We have a seal like this and this seal has got to be on top of the counter itself so that way water doesn't get down underneath the countertop itself and, and drip inside your cabinet. This is the nut that's going to be screwing onto the bottom just like this. We'll screw it up like that and then we'll tighten this up. We are going to take this piece out for now just to make it a little bit easier to work on and that way it doesn't stick down through here. But now once you get this up underneath the sink, it's going to be difficult to get up here with a pair of pliers and tighten that nut up all the way. You can do it, but it's kind of tight. So what we have to do that is it's called a, a, a basin wrench and this goes around the nut like this and then we would just turn it and tighten it up as needed. It seems pretty easy. It's a little awkward to work with because this, fla this flaps around when you're underneath there, but that's the way we're going to do it. All right, so now we're going to take this nut back off just like this. We're going to go underneath the bottom, screw it on as, as tight as we can by hand, and then we'll use our wrench to tighten it up. Now, I just want to point this out to you. When you put this on here, you do not need to use any sealant underneath here. This is a rubber seal that seals perfectly. All right, so we're going to take this, put it down through here. We're going to center it in the hole approximately. And now we'll go underneath the bottom and we're going to screw the nut on as tight as we can by hand. Okay, now this is what it looks like underneath the bottom. Just like that. It's very difficult to film it, obviously. But we're going to take this and we're going to screw this on. We're going to have our assistant hold it up on top so that it doesn't rotate. And we'll screw it down by hand as far as we can. So let me do that. Okay, so that's now as tight as we can get it. Let's grab our wrench and we'll snug it down. Got it. All right, now it's tight by hand. I got to do it with the tool. It's gonna take me a minute. Okay, so now that we have it tight down on the bottom, and as you can see, it is kind of tight down there working with something like this here. As I said, if you can get up there with a, an adjustable wrench, whatever works for you is absolutely fine. All right, this is the piece that we are going to take, and we're going to put back through here like this. We're going to fill up that bottle that came with it with the, with the, the, the soap um, that we're going to use, and that's it. This one is finished, and it's a fairly easy job. As you can see, it's very, very easy to do. Just make sure if you're replacing an existing one there, make sure that you clean the top countertop off because if you have any kind of a sediment from previous water or anything on there, it'll start to leak through there if it doesn't make a good seal. But that's it. This job is done and we're on to the next one. All right. As always, thanks for watching. See you on the next one.